Nearly eight months after a fatal stabbing in the stairwell at UT's dorms, the Lucas County Grand Jury has ruled no bill, meaning at this point no legal action will be taken against the surviving student involved in the altercation. This investigation it was certainly a difficult one. Um, it was one that um, we were the U University of Toledo Police Department was the lead in the investigation. We worked very closely with uh, Toledo Police, um, which provided incredible support from their homicide division. But the chief says TPD and UT's police department did not have enough evidence on the events of December 19th to press charges. I think that the investigation was done in a very thorough fashion. Uh, uh, it was well investigated, but it's a, it's a difficult case. Six months ago, authorities were able to reveal that 20-year-old Josiah Gallant died of stab wounds to the neck and that the case did involve drugs specifically the designer drug 25i, which can cause violent behavior and paranoia. If not but for these drugs, this incident would have never occurred. The news of no charges spread across UT's campus Tuesday, but students say they still feel safe. I figured it was a closed incident and it, I thought personally it was, uh, it could happen anywhere. Still others hope that one day justice will prevail in order not only to set an example for other people who might want to do something like this, but uh, just to have some closure for the students at UT and some peace of mind.